Hi, welcome to the video Download and Install OpenJDK 23 on Windows With me, Nam Ha Ming at Code Java.net In this video, I'd like to share with you the exact steps which you can follow to set up Java Development Kit on the Windows operating system with OpenJDK, an open source distribution of Java Development Kit Firstly, let's understand briefly about OpenJDK you know, OpenJDK is a production-ready and open-source distribution of Java Development Kit or JDK. And JDK version 23 is just a regular update of the Java SE platform. It was released on September the 17th, 2024. And OpenJDK 23 is distributed as zip archive file, no installer. To download and install OpenJDK 23 on Windows operating system, it's strongly recommended to download the uh, zip archive file of OpenJDK23 from its official download page at this URL jdk.java.net slash 23 and note that it's uh, recommended to verify the SHA-256 checksum or check the integrity of the downloaded archive file after download and for the installation extract the archive file and update the java underscore home and path environment variables and to verify the installation open a new command prompt window and type java dash version and java c dash version in the command prompt window to check the version of java virtual machine and java compiler now let me show you how to download the binary distribution of open jdk23 so head over to jdk.java.net slash 23 This is the official OpenJDK distribution page And you can see there are views for different operating systems including Windows For Windows, uh, it offers x for zip archive file here so click this zip link to download the binary distribution of OpenJDK version 23 for Windows uh, operating system. The download is in progress as you can see here. And while waiting, let me open a new command prompt window. Press the start button and type CMD and click the uh, result of that shows command prompt here to open the command prompt window okay and if i type java now you see uh, it says that java is not recognized as an internal or external command that means no java installed on this computer okay the download is complete show in folder and this is a zip archive file of the binary distribution of OpenJDK version 23 and it's strongly recommended to verify the integrity of this and downloaded archive before extracting it okay so in command prompt use the cd command to change the current directory to the download directory and you can see the zip archive file of OpenZDK version 23 here and on the official page here you can see the link SHA-256 next to the zip download link here click and then you can see the SHA-256 checksum value of the original file hosted on the uh, official download page you see and then in this command prompt we need to use a command to get the SHA-256 checksum of the downloaded file so on windows you can use the third util command with uh, parameter dash hash file and then the zip archive file name openjdk dot zip and then SHA-256 you see this command brings the SHA-256 checksum value of the specified file and we need to compare this value against the one published on the official download page if both are the same, both are identical, we can safely use the zip archive file okay, 
I see that both are the same. Okay, now the next step is to extract the downloaded zip archive file to a specific location on my computer. So I open my computer. Okay, so I cut and move the zip archive file to a new directory, new folder on my computer. Open JDK23. Best. Okay, and you can use uh, any uh, archive utility program to extract the zip archive file. Here on my Windows computer, I use WinRA. So I right click, open with, no, sorry, right click and choose extract here. Okay, and it extracted the zip archive file. I delete the zip archive file. It extracted the zip archive file into files and directory here. And you can see the binary files of the OpenZDK, OpenZDK version 23. Very simple. And the next step is uh, to configure environment variables. So open uh, start menu and type system uh, environment variables or type environment variables environment variables and click the result showing edit the system environment variables to open the system properties dialog click uh, environment variables button here and under system variables uh, click new to create a new system variable named java underscore home and the value is the installation directory of OpenJDK23 which is this one so I copy the path and paste here okay so we need to create a new system variable java underscore home like this click ok and then we need to update the path environment variable system variable here click edit and click new ng here and enter percent sign java underscore home percent sign slash bin okay and move this ng as the first ng in the path system environment variable like this okay click okay 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 and now to verify the installation, we need to exit this command prompt and open a new one. Open a new one and uh, now type Java dash version to check the Java, check the version of Java virtual machine. You see, it prints open JDK version 23.0.1. That means I have successfully installed open JDK version 23 on my Windows computer. And you can also type Java C dash version to check the version of the Java compiler. You see it prints Java C version 23.0.1. Okay, so that those are the steps to uh, set up Java Development Kit JDK with OpenJDK distribution on Windows. So that's my quick guide about uh, setting up uh, Java Development Kit on Windows operating system with OpenJDK version 23. I hope you found this video helpful. Please subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share this video. Thanks for watching.